Alright guys, scratch that. I uh, had to actually reload the save because the guards were swarming me. Um, so I just waited until nightfall and shot him. <laughs> so I'm guessing now I haven't been caught and now I should be able to fast travel a bit better. Book's not very helpful. Wait, I still didn't read. Oh, it doesn't matter. They have no idea. I can't fast travel from this spot. That was the problem. So let's get outside. <clears throat> Grab save. And off we go. Travel to the Forsaken Cave! Where'd you come from? <laughs> my dog is attacking a troll. Wait, no. My horse. Why did I just say dog? That is one big dog. I don't believe Shadowmere can actually die, so... We've got this horse for life. Charge up the mountain. Oh no, I don't want to fight a dragon. Go away. Well, here we are. We shall work by cover of night. Ah, lots and lots of books. Nothing that looks like it would benefit me. While we're here, let's talk to you. Ah, hello there, traveler. Oh, I've already to spoken to you. For food or lodging. I have nothing to tell me. Sometimes innkeepers have lots of quests. Ah, that's a good book to read. Hello, sir. Whatever it is, I'm sure I can't be of help. I'm just here on holiday. Hmm. You've served your last meal, Gourmet. Gourmet? Why, I... Uh... <laughs> oh, dear. You're going to kill me now, aren't you? Awkward. Goodbye. Let us take the writ. And get out of here. Nobody saw that. Grab another save. Oh, wait. There's something else we have to do here. Ah! I have to drag his body to a hiding place. Did not do that. Can't remember. Oh. <laughs> I'll just pick you up. That's the most awkward drag ever. Where did he go? Oh. Guess maybe we can put him back here. <laughs> Alright. Apparently I have superb ogre carrying skills.
Let's check our journal. We got a report back. The gourmet has been slain. He will never cook another meal ever again. Screw that guy. So, the prodigal murderer returns. And the gourmet? Dead. So I gathered. It seems a certain orc has disappeared. Which means you not only killed the gourmet, but disposed of the body as well. Oh, you've got the writ of passage too, I see. Splendid. Splendid. I'm just that awesome. And word has come in from Markarth that the Keep's cook has met an untimely demise. You performed your duties to the letter. All I've ever wanted to do is serve the sanctuary. <laughs> I was wrong about you. I see that now. Maybe we all were. Here's your payment. And a little something else as well. From me. Consider it my way of apologizing. For being so damn curmudgeonly. <laughs> it's called the Night Weaver's Band. I wore this for years. I want you to have it now. It'll give your magic and sneakiness some much needed oomph. Now, you'd better get a move on and see Astrid. It's time. Time for the final stage of this grand and glorious operation. Hell yeah. Yo, Astrid. Where you at? Let's grab a save as well. And up we go. Hello. So it's done. You've killed the gourmet. Oh yeah. And now Titus Mead the second is as good as dead. So it's time. We're ready to assassinate the Emperor. Oh yes. And I've decided you will have the honor. I won't disappoint you, Astrid. Or the Dark Brotherhood. Oh, I have the utmost faith in your success, believe me. So let's begin. Go now to Castle Dower in solitude. Present the Gourmet's writ of passage to the officer in charge, Commander Marrow. I'm sure you remember him. You'll gain unrestricted access to the kitchens, and then the Emperor. You're posing as a chef, so you'll be able to poison his meal rather easily. Which poison should I use? Here, take this. It's called Jaren Root. All it takes is one taste, and the effects are quite immediate. The Emperor will be serving Sithis before he even knows he's dead. Once Mead has been killed, escape through the upper door and across the bridge. I've arranged for it to be unguarded once the alarm is sounded. Now go, my friend. Go and fulfill your destiny as listener. All right. What else can you tell me about Jaren Root? It's a rare plant. Found only on the island of Stros Mackay. It can be served like any vegetable. Cut up, put in a salad, perhaps boiled in a stew. One taste will lead to nearly instant death. So don't even think about it. <laughs> Anything else before I set off? It took all the favors, bribes, and blackmails I could muster. But I've secured your exit out of the keep. Good. Just follow my instructions, and the Dark Brotherhood <clears throat> will be back on top. All thanks to you, listener. That's uh, right just then. that awesome. Let's grab a save, and off we go. It's the final stage of the Dark Brotherhood. Off we go to solitude to slay the Emperor. The city 
is crawling with Imperial Legion, and you know what? I'm still nervous. Hmm. What's that guy doing? A lot of they can't Grab even a keep Stormcloaks in line. No way I trust them with the Emperors. Stop right there. The tower is off limits until further notice. Gonna show him the writ. What's this now? Uh, order of his eminence, possessor of these papers. The Gourmet. By Azra. The Gourmet. I, I'm sorry. I didn't realize. We had no idea who to expect. You understand. They're not dressed as I would have suspected. But please, don't let me keep you. Proceed to the kitchen straight away. <coughs> Gianna, the castle chef, has been eagerly awaiting your arrival. Well, all right then. Here we are. Tis a glorious kitchen. Guess it's not stealing to take these. I can use those later. Not another delivery. I told you people our stocks are fine. Now put whatever you have over there, then get out. You misunderstand, for I am the gourmet. The gourmet? Oh, finally. When I heard the gourmet was being brought in to cook for the Emperor, I could hardly believe it. It's just Yes. I, I well. I just can't believe the gourmet is a dark elf. How difficult it must have been for you in Morrowind. The food there is... Silence! I am ready to prepare the grand feast. Oh, well, uh, actually, you're not. Wearing a chef's hat, I mean. There's one right over there on the shelf. You can't very well cook without it. I can't cook without a chef's hat? Fine. I'll put on the chef's hat. Chef's hat. Oh, just look at you. Absolutely brilliant. Now, now you're just as I imagined. <laughs> Enough! The gourmet is here to cook, not talk. Let us begin. Oh, yes, but of course. <clears throat> the Emperor has requested your signature dish, the potage le magnifique. I've taken the liberty of getting it started. But the cookbook only says so much, and everyone makes the potage differently. I would be honored if we could make it the gourmet special way. The base broth is already boiled. We can get started right now. So, uh, which ingredient should I add next? Hmm. Carrots. Carrots? Really? Okay. What next? Um, a splash of mead. Ah, of course. I suspected as much. <laughs> a giant's toe. One Nern root. Really? Oh, I use Nin root as a special seasoning all the time as well. What a wonderful idea. Okay, now what? Um, let's add a septum. A septum? <laughs> as in a gold coin? Really? Ah, I see now. That would give the Potage Le Magnifique a slightly metallic but delicious aftertaste. <laughs> Simply brilliant. Of course! I have to say, the stew seems done. Add anything else and we may dilute the distinct flavors. So, uh, is that it? Um, there's one final ingredient. Add this. Oh? What is this? Some kind of herb? Are you sure? The Potage tastes perfect as it is. Any other ingredient might... Now, now, Gianna. Who's the gourmet here? <laughs> I'm sorry. Of course, it's your most famous recipe, after all. All right, then. Your secret ingredient's been added. And if I may say so, it has been an honor getting a chance to prepare a meal with, well, the best chef in the entire empire. I'll carry the stew pot and lead the way up to the dining room. I'm sure the emperor and his guests are dying to meet you. No problem.
You could go a little faster. Grab a save. But aren't you even the least bit nervous after everything that's happened? You mean the wedding? My cousin's apparent murder? An unfortunate misunderstanding. No more. Cold mead, hot tears. Here we are. Gods, I'm nervous. We'll go in in just a moment. Please, I'll serve. You just stand there and be amazing. Yeah. Looks like I've already read that. Of your commander, what your assassination? Yes, an unfortunate turn of events that, but an isolated incident, and I have been assured. Anything of value in this book? No. Nope. That the fault was with the man's son alone. Truth is, we are in no danger whatsoever. Killing an emperor can be useful, <laughs> but befriending one, now that's beneficial, as I'm sure you'd all. Aha! Here we are, honored guests. I present to you the gourmet. Ah, the potage le magnifique. So delicious. My friends, as emperor, I of course reserve the right of first taste. <laughs> Go for it. Oh, oh, how marvelous. Just delicious. It is everything I had hoped it would be. It... I... I think something's wrong. I... Uh-oh. Oh, crap. Somebody help! Okay. in the Whoa. ship and poisoned the Emperor. Get them! Someone do something. Kill them! No, you don't understand. This Screw you guys! a mistake. I... Oh. We gotta get out of here. No time for reading. Get out of the way! Screw the Emperor! Oh, jeez. That man was, by far, the most insufferable decoy the Emperor has ever employed. Oh, no. I'm glad he's dead. But I'm even happier that you killed him. You, an assassin for the Dark Brotherhood, have just made an attempt on the Emperor's life. Would have succeeded had it been the real man. Surprised? So was I when a member of your family came to me with a plan. We worked out a deal, you see. An exchange. I get you, and the Dark Brotherhood gets to continue its existence. But you know what? I've changed my mind. How about this? I kill you, and butcher each and every one of your miserable little friends. Your sanctuary is being put to the sword right now. Oh That's no. What I think of this deal. You killed my son. All of you. And now you'll pay the price. Kill him. Make sure there's nothing left to bury. Where'd you come from? Come on! That's what you get for messing with the Dark Brotherhood. We gotta get out of here. By order of the Yard, stop right there. Hmm. I'll pay off the bounty. Smart man. Now, <coughs> come along with us. All right. No big deal. Let's see. Got to get back to the sanctuary. It's not even marked anymore. Can't fast travel to it. Just have to fast travel over here. On my horse. We'll ride over there. Look at my horse. Let me change out of the stupid chef hat. Put my helmet back on. And that's what I'm talking about. Oh, yeah, I need to level up too. Alright. Went ahead and uh, put my point into archery so I can draw my bow a little bit faster. who's chasing me, but I'm just going to keep running. Oh, wait. I'm assuming these are our enemies. Kill them! Where are the bastards? Get away from my horse!
Here we go. I'm coming, brethren! Nice. That's awesome. Pull out arrows really fast now. Shit, they're just burning the place to the ground. This sucks! That werewolf was my friend! How dare you! That is a really helpful perk. Oh! I keep thinking it says Nazi. <laughs> Kill the Nazi attacker. Can't see him. This sucks! Go down! Quick, save the night, mother! I'm surprised they're still running around in here. Hmm. Let's go back in my journal. <clears throat> so we just have to kill all of them. Oh! Dropped him. I want my arrows back, fool. So you are alive. I was starting to wonder. Oh yeah. The Emperor. It was all a trap. Someone set us up. Considering most of us are now dead, <laughs> I assumed as much. And before you ask, no, I don't think it was you. <laughs> well, maybe I did. But you're saving my sorry hide just now sort of erased any doubts. <laughs> so, thanks. No problem. We need to get out of here. You've got that right. Only a matter of time before Roasted alive. Come on. Charge. Listener, I am your only salvation. Come, embrace me. All right, I'll give you a hug. Way out of here. I'm just gonna get in here real quick. Oh. That sounded nasty. Devil, I don't see you helping. I'm not exactly built for manual labor. Now come on, you've almost got it. One more pull. Yeah. There. Can you get it open? I think so. Just hold on a moment. You must speak with Astrid here in the Dark Brotherhood Sanctuary. Hey, just chilling in this coffin. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Slow down. It's all right. Been through a lot. Maybe you should just sit down for a bit. I have to speak with Astrid. She's here in the sanctuary. Follow me. She's here? 
My Sithis, I thought we'd lost her. Let's go. Charge. Oh, okay, the place isn't on fire anymore. <laughs> nice job putting down the flames. Oh. <coughs> alive. You're alive. <laughs> Thanks, Sithis. <coughs> Astrid. Shh. <coughs> Please. <coughs> There is much I have to say, <coughs> and not much time. <coughs> I'm sorry, <coughs> so very sorry. The Penitus Oculatus, Marrow, he said that by giving you to them, he would leave the Dark Brotherhood alone, forever. Oh, my Sithis, I was such a fool. All of this, it's all my fault. You are the best of us. And I nearly killed you, as I've killed everyone else. You'll be judged by Sithis in the Void. I pity you. No, don't pity me. I deserve whatever fate the Dread Lord has in store. I betrayed you, and now Mero has betrayed me. <laughs> Fitting. I just wanted things to stay the way they were. Before Cicero. Before the Night Mother. Before you. I thought I could save us. I was wrong. But you're alive. So there's still a chance. A, a chance to start over. Rebuild. That's why I did this don't you see i prayed to the night mother i am the black sacrament what are you saying i'm saying you were right the night mother was right the old ways they guided the dark brotherhood for centuries i was a fool to oppose them and to prove my <gasps> sincerity I have prayed for a contract. You lead this family now. I give you the Blade of Woe, so that you can see it through. You must kill me. Okay. Shoot you in the face. Uh, thank you. No problem. I'm gonna loot you. Bitch. Return to the night, mother. Oh, night, mother. Astrid is dead. It is as it should be. May she find redemption in the void. But while you live, the Dark Brotherhood lives. We must fulfill our contract. Emperor Titus Mead II must be eliminated. Speak with Armand Mortier at the Bannered Mare in Whiterun. He will know the true Emperor's location. But first, Inform Nasir of your plans, for you are the listener, and must bind this family together. Sounds like a plan. <laughs>